What's up guys? Welcome to a very special Christmas edition of Extreme Rundown. Today I'm going to be answering all your questions that you commented on last week's episode. So I'm going to have this guy ask the question. Yes, that's me. And this guy answer the question. Hi there! Yes, that's also me. So let's get to it. What software do you use to edit your videos? Sony Vegas Pro 9 and maybe Tenzoom. Where do you come up with the ideas for your videos? How do I come up with ideas for my videos? Hmm. It's all in the jugular. Are you a public speaker? No. How do you do all those voices? Do you mean this one? 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 Or do you mean this one? Where did you get your YouTube jacket from? Google. How long do you want to continue to make videos on YouTube? I'm going to keep going forever because I love this stuff too much to stop. How long have you been a wrestling fan? I've been a wrestling fan since about 2005, 2006. Who is your father? You are. Can you give me a shout out? Shout out to David Burns Vlogs. If you could be a WWE superstar for a day, who would you be and why? If I could be a superstar for the day, I'd say The Miz because his push is going through the roof. If you could create your own match, what would it be? My own match? I'd like to see the Nexus take over the entire WWE. Who do you think is the future of WWE? Well, Sheamus, John Morrison, The Miz, the entire Nexus, Evan Bourne, and the list goes on. When will you bring back XBWF? There are a number of conflicting factors in this, most notably copyright, but at least it's still here in spirit. WWE or TNA? WWE. Question. What do you do with the belts? They're great collectible items, and I'm pretty sure they'll be worth something in the future when they go out of production. What are they used for? They are used for decoration. Why don't you just do one match of XPWF every once in a while? Like every other month. Like WWE pay-per-views. You spoiled my surprise for what's to come. What do you want to do in the future? I want to continue doing this in the future, making videos for you guys. Do your friends watch your videos? Of course they do. What channel of yours is your most favorite to make videos for? Stingray or 9 all the way. What's your favorite food? Want fish sticks? What is your favorite song? It was the summer of 69. In case you noticed, I can't sing. What is your favorite video you ever made? I would have to say my recent Christmas video, which is BAM right here. In case you haven't seen it yet, go check it out because it's got an epic ending to it and it's awesome. But be sure to continue to watch this Q&A first because I can't hold my breath anymore. How long does it take you to film a video on Stingray 809? It does not consume my entire weekend at all. It just takes a few hours. I wish. What camera do you use now? A Samsung HZ50W. Why don't you use the green screen? I do use it a lot on my main channel, Stingray 9. What is your favorite WWE belt of all time? I would have to say the World Heavyweight Championship because it's awesome. If you could make a WWE belt, what would it be? I'd throw a television title back on TV. What did you watch on TV when you were young? Barney! If you could do a video with a different YouTuber, who would it be? There's a number of different people. Computer nerd, Shane Dawson, Fred! How are you? I'm doing good. What's your favorite Stingray channel? Stingray 9 once again, but the vlogs are a lot of fun to do too. Do you want to be a WWE superstar? And who would you like to be your tag team partner? I used to, but if I had to choose a tag team partner, I'd choose you, Pikachu! What kind of music do you like? Turn the volume up. We're ready to go! Are you going to get more WWE belts? No, probably not. My question, how come the real ECW 2008 version looks more grayish than the replica? I have no idea. And finally, how do I convince my mom and dad who hate WWE to let me get a replica, even if it's just a mini? Tell them how much you love it, and maybe they'll let you get one. That's it. Every single question that has been commented has been answered. So let me know in the comments box down below, should I do more Q&As in the future? Should I do them on my main channel, or should I do them on this channel? So what do you think? Just let me know if I should do more Q&As in the future, um, because I believe I can make a very fun Q&A on Stingray 9, so that will be very fun to look forward to as well. And also I want to say, from me to you, have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, even though I'll probably see you guys all the time before that, but yeah, have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and I hope you enjoyed this Christmas edition of Extreme Rundown, because it was a lot of fun to make, and you guys make it happen.